Minecraft Snapshot 23W17A added a new music disc. This music disc is by Aaron Sheroff and it's called Relic. Let's have a listen. Oh my gosh, this is a bop! Yes! If only you could see the smile on my face right now. Wow. Oh, that is such a good song. It's a relic, ladies and gentlemen. That is what the music disc looks like. It's a beautiful song. I love it. If only I had a face cam so that you could see the smile on my face the entire time I was listening to that. It was amazing. My mouth was wide open for the first, like, 30 seconds of the song. <laughs> Hello, my name is Nyla Liade, and welcome back to another snapshot video. This is snapshot 23W17A, and there are three new features in this snapshot. Added new advancements for Tales and Trails. Added new Tales and Trails ambient music. Added a new music disc obtainable through archaeology, which is this relic music disc by Aaron Sheroff. In total, there are seven new advancements in this update. Three new husbandry advancements, 
and four new adventure advancements. You get the first advancement, Smells Interesting, by obtaining a sniffer egg. So, let's try and dig around for a minute and find a sniffer egg. Actually, before I go digging for the sniffer egg, I'm just going to list off all of the advancements and how you get them because I've just realized as I started doing this that I can potentially get another advancement from looking for the sniffer egg. So to get smells interesting, like I said, you obtain a sniffer egg. Little sniffs, you have to feed a snifflet and it requires smells interesting to get little sniffs. Planting the past, you have to plant any sniffer seed. It requires little sniffs to get this advancement. A lot of these advancements require the other advancement to get it. For respecting the remnants, you have to brush a suspicious block to obtain a pottery sherd. Careful restoration, make a decorated pot out of four pottery sherds. Requires respecting the remnants to get careful restoration. Crafting a new look, craft a trimmed armor at a smithing table. Smithing with style, apply these smithing templates at least once. Spire, Snout, Rib, Ward, Silence, Vex, Tide, and Wayfinder. Requires crafting a new look. Let's get back to looking for that sniffer egg. A lot of hoes around here. Ooh, a pottery shirt. That is our first advancement, respecting the remnants. Alright, I don't think there's any more suspicious sand around here. Let's go find another warm ocean ruin. Let's see if we find a sniffer egg at this ocean ruin. Is there even any suspicious sand around this structure?
I think that's it right there. Yes. Smells interesting. We finally got a sniffer egg from brushing the suspicious sand. I thought for a minute I was going to have to do these last little bits of suspicious sand and then just go into the creative inventory and give myself the sniffer egg to get the advancement because we kind of got to move on. That took a long time to get that. For little sniffs, I need to feed a snifflet, and to feed a snifflet, I kind of need to hatch one first. So let's grab some moss. Alright, with the moss, it should only take about 10 minutes to hatch my sniffer. My sniffer hatched! Yay! Alright, let's get it to a seed to feed. I believe this works with the torch flower seeds and the pitcher pods. Little sniffs! Yay! Alright, the last husbandry advancement is planting the past. We just have to plant any sniffer seed. Let's grab one of the many hoes I got from trying to find the sniffer egg. I got a seedy place and planting past. We already have one of the adventure advancements respecting the remnants. We did that by brushing a suspicious block to obtain a pottery sherd. Now, careful restoration. Make a decorated pot out of four pottery sherds. There's a phantom. I'm in creative mode, so they won't harm me. Phantoms are actually kind of cool when they don't attack you at random moments. This sniffer is so cute when it follows me. I mean, it's Snifflet. It's the baby one. Oh, he's so cute. Just look at him waddle. All right, let's make a pot. Careful restoration. Here's my pot. Don't you think it's beautiful? All right, so these last two adventure advancements are possible to get at the same time. Crafting a new look, craft a trimmed armor at a smithing table. Smithing with style, apply these smithing templates at least once. Spire, snout, rib, ward, silence, vex, tide, or wayfinder. I'm just gonna take this armor set that I have right here. Of course, I'm going to choose the Silence Armor Trim. I also need a smithing table. And I'm going to use Amethyst. We got Crafting a New Look. Okay, so the reason why we didn't get smithing with style at the same exact time is because you need Crafting a New Look to get smithing with style. So if I do this chest plate, I should get smithing with style. 
Do I have to apply all of those? At least once? Is that what that means? I was thinking that this meant that you had to choose either Spire, Snout, Rib, Ward, Silence, Vex, Tide, or Wayfinder, but I think that it actually means that you have to apply... Jeez, way to get in my shot. I think it actually means that you have to apply each and every one of those at least once to one piece of armor. I'm still gonna wear this armor because I think it looks super cool. The sniffer agrees. Alright, these are all of these smithing templates that you need to get this advancement. Total of eight. Yes, yes. I know, very interesting. There we go. Smithing with style. And there's all of those chest plates right there. All right, that is all the time I have left for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell notification button so that you get notified every time I post a video. Usually, if a snapshot comes out during the week, I post a video about it on Saturday. Every Tuesday at 3 p.m. EST, I post a Minecraft Survival Let's Play video. And on Thursdays, at the same time, I have been posting Minecraft Legends content. Based on the fact that this snapshot has the music being added for this update, I think 1.20 is coming out very soon. When this update comes out, I am planning on starting a hardcore series in 1.20. I have never played hardcore Minecraft before, despite being a Java player, so if you're interested in seeing me play hardcore mode in 1.20, subscribe. That will be coming pretty soon. Alright, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!